Alright, YouTube and Facebook. I just thought I would make a quick video here. We're still experimenting with the layout uh, back in here. But uh, we just got our deep freeze pulled back in here and I had a thought. Uh, Mom has on several occasions had to give away or cook a bunch of food and, because the power flickered rapidly during inclement weather which caused the deep freeze at her house to either not power back on completely or, or tear something up in it. And, you know, she didn't notice it for a day or two, and then the food started to thaw out. So she basically had to get rid of it before it went rancid. And so when we moved our deep freeze back in here, I had a thought. We have several of these uninterruptible power supplies here that I use primarily to power televisions and things of that nature. For those of you who don't know, basically this is a giant battery. It plugs into the wall. All your stuff plugs into this. And then your stuff runs off the battery in here and then the battery is being continuously recharged from the wall. What it does is not it not only does it act as a surge protector, but because your stuff is already running off the battery if the power goes out, there is no change over. Your stuff doesn't go off because it's already running off the battery. Uh, the only thing that'll happen is this will thing will light up and beep until you silence it and tell you that there's no power input. And so I said, "You know what? Let's run the deep freeze." off this up and see what kind of a load it draws. So right now we've got 122 volts in. You can see there's a little load meter right here. It's not even just one bar. 131 watts drawn and I passed it up here. Estimated runtime 44 minutes. And that's with the compressor on the deep freeze running because it's got to cool itself back down. It's been unplugged for several days. So let's go ahead and power on the server here. So we'll have this deep freeze, the router, and our home server all running off this ups at the same time. Now we're up to two bars, 27 minutes run time. Just say half an hour runtime with these three items running off of this battery backup if the power were to go out right now. So, to show you guys how this basically works, you can see that all of the stuff is plugged into it. And the only thing that's going on, let me unmute it here so you guys can hear it. There we go. And the ups itself is plugged in back here. So, let's pretend that the power just flipped off. So, the power just went off to the house. And you can see, you can hear the fan kicked in because it's discharging, but all of our stuff is still running. So, this should hopefully save our deep freeze from damage caused by power flashes, outages, things of that nature and if the power's out for several days we could just turn the ups off and turn it on once a day for a few minutes so let the deep freeze cool back down and keep our food frozen so that's pretty cool I was just uh, curious as to whether or not this would actually run this deep freeze this one right here this ups I think you can get a similar model for I think like a hundred dollars ish. This is a 1500 amp hour uh, APC brand uninterruptible power supply. There's different companies that make them but uh, this is the one that we have several of around the house and uh, pretty cool thing. I recommend everybody get at least a couple of them and put them on your important items, your televisions, possibly your fridge and things of that nature. Things that if the power flickered and it blew up, you'd be out a bunch of money to replace it. So, just wanted to kind of show this off and uh, demonstrate how the things work. Y'all take care.